Welcome. In this video, we are going to take a look at problem one from chapter 29 of College Physics 2E by OpenStax. In this problem, we have a molecule. It's oscillating with a known frequency. We need to find the difference in energy in electron volts between allowed oscillator states. And then we need to find the approximate value for n given the energy. Okay, let's start with what we know. Okay, we know the frequency is 1.7 times 10 to the 13 hertz. And we need to find the difference in energy between allowed states. Then given an energy of 1.0 electron volts, we need to find the value of n. Okay, so we'll start with delta E. And we can use delta E is h times f, where h is Planck's constant, f is the frequency. We can substitute the values. H is 6.626 times 10 to the minus 34 joules times seconds. We're going to need this in EVs, so let's just convert that now. One electron volt is 1.60 times 10 to the minus 19 joules. Okay, that takes care of H. Our frequency is 1.7 times 10 to the 13 hertz. Okay, I did the calculation and I found delta E is 7.04 times 10 to the minus 2 EVs. And so to two sig figs, delta E is 7.0 times 10 to the minus 2 electron volts. Okay, now for part B, we need to find N, and we can use the equation E is equal to the quantity N plus 1 half times HF. Okay, so we'll solve for N plus 1 half. That's going to be E divided by HF. And so N is going to be E divided by HF minus 1 half. Okay, the given E is 1.0 electron volts. We just found HF, right? HF is the same as delta E, so we'll just use that. 7.0 times 10 to the minus 2 EVs. Then we subtract them 1 half. And I found N is 13.7. Now, n is a non-negative integer. That means it can be 0 or a positive integer. So we need to round this, and we will round it up and say n is going to be approximately 14. I hope you found that helpful. Let me know in the comment section if you have any questions. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.